Hello everyone, it's me again, Colton Rhodes, if you didn't watch the first episode of Confessions of a Nerdy Meathead. Right now I'm eating a, I'll show you, it is a pot of honeycombs, because I don't use bowls normally, because they don't make bowls that big, and I like cereal a lot, but um, today, so far, I've called the doctor about scheduling my appointment for my knee. Looks like I'm not I gotta wait two weeks before I can be seen because I missed my first appointment. The reason I missed my first appointment is because they scheduled an appointment for me, but they didn't call me to let me know when that appointment is. I guess that makes sense. I should just know when to go to the doctor that I've never been to before. I don't know, but that's a completely different thing. I went to the bank today, as I have the last few weeks, because I got a different job. And so I get paid about once a week, almost every day now, as opposed to once a month for school. And now everyone at the bank is wondering, because I, cause I normally, you know, I wouldn't even show up to the bank, but maybe once every couple months, because I had direct deposit before, and now I deposit cash. So they all assume I'm involved in some sort of illegal activity and they're trying to guess what that is now I have I'm I'm weird so I've been I've been saying all kinds of weird stuff to them like I I kinda led them on to think I'm involved in some sort of gang activity um, one of them was wondering if I was selling drugs and which no that's true I I'm working a legitimate job but it's funny to think that that they think I am doing some illegitimate work to get money. I've had all kinds of things. They, one asked if I was an enforcer for a gang or something, and I was like, uh, no, you know, I can't really get into it. And I'm just like being real mysterious about it. And it's hilarious because I like to mess with people sometimes. I think everyone likes to mess with people. But it's a blast. So I was, I've been doing that. Getting closer to getting that computer, I've been talking about getting, so hopefully I get that soon, because I want to make some legit videos where I can add some editing and uh, and some gameplay and stuff, because sometimes I'm a pretty decent Call of Duty player, and I like playing other games too, so that could be fun. Uh, I might hopefully get to meet uh, Angelo, from your Angelo Death, 1990. This week he has moved back to Oklahoma, which is where I live, and we're going to meet up. Hopefully we'll get to make a video when we meet. I don't know. I think it would be really cool, but we'll see what happens. Um, yeah. Um, yeah. Oh. No, I, I almost had something. Give me a second. Almost at it. I'm gonna lift some weights here in a second. I got some dumbbells by my my setup. Actually, I wonder if I can show you my setup on the webcam. Be cool. Yeah, I just got some. Look, there's my Black Ops 3 poster. Booty. <laughs> there's freaking booty. Yeah, that's like a sketch. It's got it's pretty nice booty. And then there we got my uh, monitor, my Xbox One, my laptop. It's an old laptop. I got some surround sound. Here's my computer monitor. It's not nearly as good as that one. But a little Logitech keyboard and a printer and some school shit. My axe makes you smell like a man. I don't know. And then, uh, yeah, there's all that shit. Oh, I got a scuff too. You see my scuff? Ah, point the right direction. Yeah, my scuff and my Astros. Um. Shouldn't have adjusted that. Alright. So, got all that stuff. Um, I think that's it. How's that all I just talked about today? So, I'll find out about my knee in about two, by the end of the month. We'll see. Um, it really sucks. It's really put a freaking huge break to my powerlifting career, but I've been working on the gaming and stuff more. That's it. I'll check you all later. Have a great day as usual.
And if anyone wants to play with me or hook up on Xbox One, let me know. Take it easy, everybody.